Hello and welcome. Welcome to our February abundance class. These uh, monthly abundance journeys happen every first of the month, every first weekday of the month. So if it's a weekend, then you can come back on the uh, following weekday. And the URL for uh, joining the class, um, uh, the, U the page uh, which has the URL for joining the class remains the same throughout the year. So feel free to bookmark it. And also you can just set a reminder every uh, first weekday of the month or every first of the month, um, you know, just so you remember. Um, generally, you know, when we have uh, an email going out that morning uh, or a few days before that, then I will uh, also announce it. So you can look out for that. So, um, Happy New Year to you. It is the Chinese New Year, the year of the tiger, especially the year of the water tiger. And um, it is also an energetic New Year. The Western New Years are more connected to accounting, but the, uh, some of the other New Years like the Chinese New Year is more connected to the energetic cycle and the changes of elements in the year. Uh, for the planet. So this is a year of um, being bold and taking action. It is also a water element year. So that means the year automatically will have a lot of fluctuation energies. Now the last two years were metal years and you may have felt like, um, you know, some people felt like uh, uh, things were stuck not moving forward that much, or um, you, know, you may have felt that um, you are kind of where you were, even though you may have made progress, but you weren't sure. You know, um, it felt like, or some parts of the year felt like stuck energy. It's the metal energy, right? It's, it's not a fast moving energy. It's more of, about building foundation and solidify your foundation, solidify your vision and more. Uh, this year and next year are water years. That means very, very fast moving year. And you want to go with the flow. Uh, the way to really stay above global issues and surrounding issues is to keep moving forward with the focused vision. And that's where the year of the tiger energy comes in very strongly. Because imagine a tiger going for hunting, and in this case, or in your case, hunting would be approaching your vision. So you want to move towards your vision with a focus. Doesn't matter what's happening around you or outside of you or in your city, state, country, or on the, on the planet. Doesn't matter what corporations are doing, governments are doing, industries are doing. They make a difference. Yes, everything ultimately matters, but you're not caught up in that. You know, that's what I mean by it doesn't matter. You filter those out and you stay on your path and keep moving forward. Just like a stream, imagine a mountain stream. It's coming down the mountain. You want to move forward fast. So get ready for that. You know, don't think um, that you're on a boat and, you know, there's going to be a lot of turbulence. It doesn't matter. Uh, think about this to be like, uh, let's say you are approaching the Niagara Falls. You know, if you have uh, ever gone there or visited there, uh, those um, um, steamers or launches, I don't know what they call them, uh, that take you toward the Niagara Falls, you know, they go up and down a lot. So imagine the year is bringing in all these water energies and wavy energies. So you can tune into those energies, use those energies as your power source, and then keep moving forward. So really, you know, if you haven't decided on some of your priorities, you know, we, uh, we focused on it uh, in the month of January for M3. So we decide on the outcome of the year and then really um, 
solidify some of our major priorities, like three to five priorities, and we solidify an outrageous vision. And throughout the year, we continue to boost the vibration, uh, create alignment, and also every month we tune into the global changing energies. So if you have not been a part of it, uh, still think about some of your priorities, let's say the top three priorities, and think about the best case scenario. What is it that you would love to attract or create or manifest? Now think about those. Imagine those energies becoming a vortex for you. So these are the results that you desire. It could be a golden vortex or a rose vortex or a rose gold vortex or a rainbow vortex. You know, you choose. Generally, I associate, it, I associate the colors based on um, uh, the, what they represent. So if your focus is about abundance, success, and prosperity, then think about a golden vortex. If it's more about love and relationship, think about a rose vortex. If it's more about healing, think about an emerald green vortex. If it's more about your higher vision, purpose, cosmic alignment, and more, then think about a starry blue vortex. Now, if your goals or your focus um, and the priorities uh, touch all these different areas, then think about a mixed vortex. That's rose, gold, emerald, and starry blue. All those different colors representing different frequencies are spiraling through the vortex and step inside that vortex every day for uh, let's say eight minutes. Why eight? Because it's a fun number and it's a very small number. Everybody can do eight minutes a day and they can do eight minutes a day multiple times a day if you'd like. So let's keep playing with the energies and feel free to add any other holographic tools and programs no, uh, through, uh, in the process. So as we move into the water element year, um, uh, and as we go through it for the next two years, uh, understand that water also brings in uh, the flow of abundance energies. So the way you would plug in uh, a socket or, or, or um, let's say an um, a computer or a phone to an electrical outlet, uh, imagine you are plugging into the water element to give yourself a boost. You know, all the elements work with each other. Um, I will talk more about that in some of the uh, future feng shui preview classes, but just imagine that water energy is bringing you a lot of power sources uh, for the year and a lot of energy and information for the year. So as you run the vortex energies, you are tuning into your higher vision and purpose. And the element of the year and the characteristics of the year are helping you to get um, a big boost. And so just play with those energies that way. So today, you know, we will focus on the global celebration energy, you know, because as we transitioned into an energetic new year and more than a billion people on the planet celebrated it, it's powerful to tune into those energies. February is also the month of love. So as we tune into celebration energies, uh, we will also bring in high vibration love and support energies and healing energies for us. And then we will run the vortex for all of us for our year and then expand it worldwide. So in our journey today, uh, tune into those energies. And I, I am often uh, quiet when I'm running different processes in your mind and in your heart, keep running the vortex for you and then uh, ultimately for your world. So you are having that clockwise spinning energies of love and celebration spiraling through every cell of your body, through every day of a year, and then through the entire planet.
and every part of the planet. So let's play with these energies. And um, now throughout the year, whenever you notice issues, challenges, disharmony, uh, or things happening that you don't like, unplug yourself from it. Imagine you are connected to those energetically, the way your phone can be connected to a USB for powering it up. So unplug your connection from those issues, challenges, and then plug them into golden spheres. Golden spheres represent abundant and prosperous energies. Okay, So keep that in your mind and um, now do that for others too. When you have clients, members, family, you know, who may be experiencing issues or challenges, unplug them and plug them into a golden sphere or a rose sphere or an emerald green sphere, depending on what they need. Let's begin our journey and processing today. Gently close your eyes. Focus on your heart. And begin to breathe in and out. Let's bring up spiraling earth energies from the center of earth and allow those energies to come up through your lower chakras and your feet for grounding. Let's bring down the spiraling rays of the sun through your higher chakras and your crown. You are inside a vortex between the earth and the sun. Allow the energies to spiral through you up and down. And notice your sensations. Let's now tune into the celebration energies for the year of the tiger. Notice people from all over the world celebrating. Tune into the highest vibration of celebration. Notice the multicolored waves spiraling through the entire planet. Notice a celebration vortex energy spiraling through you. And it's also spiraling through your year. It's flowing through every day of this year for you. In your mind, you can picture the calendar year. Notice every day inside a celebration vortex. It's spinning very, very fast. 
and it's getting stronger every day. Keep breathing in and out. Allow the energies to keep getting stronger for you and for the world. Continue to breathe in and out. Let's infuse the energies of roses and the vibration of love into the vortex. Notice the love and celebration vortex becoming even stronger for you and for your world.
Notice the energies with all of your senses. Picture the vortex in your mind. Hear the sound. Feel the energy. Notice the smell. Notice the taste. Notice in every way you can. Notice the energy in your heart. Notice the energy spiraling through every cell of your body. Nourish yourself. Nourish your energy. Allow the vortex of love and celebration to become a power source for you. Allow your energy centers to charge from this power source. Notice your body, your cells, your energy centers, and your year all charged to While the vortex continues to spiral through you, begin to focus on your top three priorities. Think about the end results that you desire. Keep them simple. Allow the vortex energies to empower you to achieve what you desire.
Continue to breathe in and out deeply and gently. Let's keep focusing on what you desire, your top priorities. Continue to receive the vibration from the mega vortex to empower you and to create the options so you can receive what you desire. Let's breathe in and out. Notice the vortex energies getting even stronger. The energies are also spiraling through the entire planet, boosting the vibration. Raise your vibration. Allow the next level of information for you to show up with ease and grace. Let's breathe in and out deeply and gently a few more times. So 
Let's come back to your present moment. Rub your hands together and gently open your eyes. Welcome back. The vortex energy felt fun and powerful because uh, we are connecting with a lot of celebration energies. Whenever you have the opportunity to connect with any kind of massive celebration energies, uh, feel free to do that and remember to do that because those energies can become strong power sources for you. The way you need to uh, charge your phone or computer time to time or quite often, um, you know, think about these vortex energies are uh, power stations and power sources for you. So you plug yourself into these vortex energies. It doesn't matter what kind of celebration. It could be celebration of a country, a culture, um, a year, new year, or anything else, uh, anything that's empowering. So think about those causes and tune into those energies. So when you give yourself that huge boost, then with that boost, you can move forward faster. It's like your battery, your chakras, your meridians are fully charged. So then you can tune into healing energies faster. You can tune into your vision more. You can tune into more abundance and keep having those vortex energies run for you. So let's play with these energies throughout the month. Um, also remember that uh, the holographic feng shui setup will start somewhere around the mid-February. Uh, if you haven't um, signed up yet, you know, there is a queue, so um, I will start processing based on uh, how I receive the orders. So if you are waiting, then you know, you'll be more toward the end. Um, but um, yeah, just uh, play with the energies. Um, and I, as I mentioned in the beginning of uh, the call, um, that uh, you know, with water tiger energy, you know, it's really important for us to you know, solidify our vision and keep moving forward, you know, regardless of all the splashes and fluctuations of water energy. You know, so water has a rhythm, like ocean waves may look like or sound like they're just splashing onto the shore, but there's a rhythm. So tune into the energy so you can find the rhythm. So let's play with these energies. And um, also remember um, every Friday, you know, we meet um, on our own to you know, review the uh, journey from Awaken Your Inner Light program. We will do that for the next three months. It's a very powerful journey with frequencies of miracles, with um, music in the background. Uh, that's also energized with the miracle frequencies. So let's keep running all these energies together. So this is a very, very powerful year for massive inner and global transformation. The fast moving water energy brings us the opportunities to move into many different directions. So let's take advantage of it. Um, unplug from non-beneficial information, media, scary news and stuff. You know, it's just another, uh, it has become a daily practice now. Uh, so then you know, you're guided in certain ways and um, that's disempowering. Unplug from those and start to calibrate with high vibration energies. All right, so thanks for joining. And do remember that uh, Thursday, um, we have the um, M3 class where you know each um, month we have a new one where we focus on your vision vortex, um, your outrageous vision and more. And I'll be also bringing the monthly energies. And then on Sunday, you know, we have the 
uh, Legend of the White Tiger. That's an ancient uh, super constellation. Uh, and, you know, it has stars from many different constellations. So we will have a cosmic creation uh, for the first time um, with the uh, tiger, white tiger super constellation. So join us and let's keep playing with the energies and let's keep circulating the energies for you and for the planet. So thanks for joining, wishing you a lot of magic.